Hello bookworms and welcome to another video. We're gonna try something today. I'm not sure if this is going to work out how I hope that it does, but I got from the films of Harry Potter, the pop-up guide to Hogwarts. So shiny. And I had posted a little walkthrough on Insta stories and um, asked if I should try to do a full walkthrough on YouTube and it was a yes. So it's going to be tricky with the equipment that I have for videoing, but we're going to try to make it work. Keep watching if you love Harry Potter and or you want to laugh about me trying to film a pop-up look. If you're interested, I'm going to kind of do a general overview and of my face kind of talking and then I will flip the camera around and show you the smaller details um, up close and personal. Um, I just think that will be best instead of me trying to fumble around. Is that not amazing? So when you open it, it's Hogwarts on the first page and it is so detailed back of Hogwarts and I'm gonna read it and then show it to you. Welcome to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry where students come from all over Britain to study a wide curriculum of magical skills. The, the castle, the headmaster's office, um, so this is really cool too if you've been, like if you're just a fan of the movies or if you're a fan of the amusement park, um, this is pretty cool. And it's also really neat because then even like in the big ones, you have these like little um, things that you can open and like this is Dumbledore's office and um, like you pull that open and you can kind of see inside of the castle and it's just really neat. It says, classes are taught in classrooms throughout Hogwarts Castle from the tops of the towers to the deepest dungeons, and sometimes elsewhere on the grounds. Charms class is taught by Professor Flitwick. Professor Trelawney teaches divination and transfiguration is taught by Professor McGonagall, who demonstrates the subject by transfiguring herself into a cat. And it just kind of gives those little, like, things you already know if you're a fan, but just fun to read it in a different way, in a different voice. I love this one. This is so fun. The Quidditch field. Isn't that so fun though? Oh, I love it. It just gives a little blurb about Quidditch and what it is. And Oh my gosh. This is of course Hogsmeade Village, which I am super acquainted with now that I've been to Universal. And this is so fun. It kind of just has the little village and like it has the shrieking shack. And again, it just has little doors that pop open. It's so detailed. Like if you're a fan, um, oh, by the way, this is 70, a $75 book. I would never pay I'm just not a collector like that and so I wouldn't pay the money I'm not saying I don't think it's worth it but I found this book from Barnes and Noble on sale for like 30 bucks you can find it on sale obviously this is the forbidden forest or maybe not so obviously if you're not a big fan um and then it's got Hagrid's hut right here and you open the door and that's so cute just outside the grounds of hogwarts lies the forbidden forest which as the name implies is strictly off limits to hogwarts students except in cases of detention or under the supervision of the care of magical creatures professor 10 points to your house if you know who that is okay even the back and the front are super beautiful and super detailed this pops off to give more room for the pop-ups pop 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 that's today's theme so so yeah okay let's do let's do a walkthrough 
Okay, so a closer look inside. And like I said, you can pull these open and there's Dumbledore. Hogwarts houses. As we know, you get sorted by the sorting hat your first year. And the staircase. Super, super beautiful. Love that it just is so 3D. Each house dormitory has a protected entrance, and this is the fat lady that protects the Gryffindor dormitory. And then this is Gryffindor's flag, and then if you pull this, so you say the password, and there are the Weasley twins, and Jenny Weasley, and Nearly Headless Nick. And then my house is a Ravenclaw, Slytherin, and Hufflepuff. So then you pull this. And these are what the houses are known for. I just love the detail of this. I mean, and then you just tuck this back in. I'll go over here. The three heroes, the golden trio, if you will. So you pull this. And there's Hermione Granger. And with her time turner. And Harry. And there's Ron. Here's another view of the castle. This looks like I've seen better days, y'all. This is Tom Riddle's diary. And Tom Riddle's diary from the Chamber of Secrets that Harry puts a basilisk thing through. And then I am Lord Voldemort, which we know Tom Riddle and Lord Voldemort are the same. We come down here, the room of requirement that Dumbledore's army uses. And here we have the professors. Let's get a better look. We pull a tab and McGonagall turns into a cat. And there's Hagrid, Professor Trelawney. How fun is this? And then down here, Dobby. Look how cute with his sock. And then over here, we know Professor Quarrel and Gilderoy Lockhart. Lupin and Mad-Eye. And that bitch and Snape. And so as you just kind of flip through, which I think is so cool. And then you just close all this. And then we are on to the Quidditch pitch, which is so fun. Talks a little about the Tri Wizard Tournament.
And if you'll remember, these are who competed in the Triwizard Cup. And we had the Dragon Challenge, the egg that Harry took a bath with, and the Triwizard Cup itself. Dementors on the Quidditch pitch, and there's Harry, and then we open this, got the Order of the Phoenix, oh I love Tonks, and then we have this that you pull. And so we have Sirius Transfiguring, which I think is so cool how they did that pop up. Go on to Hogsmeade Village. And as you can see, it's so detailed. You can even see in, you're not really supposed to do that. But. And then we know that Harry can't get his permission slip to go to the village, so Fred and George give him the map that we know so well. Let me pull this open and we can see Peter Pettigrew and the steps and then the different rooms. And then it just folds back up. That one's a little difficult to get open. Um, last but not least, we're at the Forbidden Forest, Hagrid's we also have the Ford Anglia. Aragog. over here <laughs> and as we know Harry Potter and Voldemort have their final confrontation in Deathly Hallows part two the Forbidden Forest. You open this and we've got Buckbeak and we have Aragog and then Thestrals. So that's it you guys I hope that that was fun for you that you enjoyed it if you did like this video subscribe to my channel and let me know if you would like me to do more fun little videos like this and I'll see you later